What's going on guys? Welcome to Cards from the Basement. My name is Tip. Starting collecting cards with my buddy Kevin. We're doing this together. We just started. Come follow us on the journey. Let's go. Episode 1. edition so you got rookies like LaMelo Ball, Anthony Edwards, Cole Anthony. Hopefully we can strike some gold in here and come away with something but either way it's just exciting. We've now been investing in cards. This is a recent thing that you want to know how much time we put into investing cards before we decided to start a show about it. About, about a week off eBay. I mean, and just, just to say scrolling. a week is generous I would say first card was purchased seven days ago and in that time frame we invested about seven hours max of education. So one hour a day. You know, a couple, half of a couple YouTube videos put it together yep. and yep. here we are yep. buying packs of cards. So. Yep. yep. So so episode one. The inaugural episode. So as you can see, we went out and we uh, bought our first pack. So we're going to be unveiling those later. So we started this journey out. Like I said, we, we bought a few cards in our early days. We went home to our childhood collection. I looked through. I found some found some gems. Decided to show off. So it just in this in this past week, uh, I've already collected five different Joel Embiid cards here. These are from the 2021-2022 season. The current NBA season, which I hope is his MVP year. But yeah, I found these off eBay. Although these are cool, you know, this is my favorite one. This was the this is the one I got my first bidding war mm -hmm. off of. Although these are cool, rookie cards are more value than current cards. You know, like a LeBron rookie card is gonna be worth more than a random LeBron year eight because that's like the first incarnation, the first images, the first cards of somebody's career who, you know, those rookie cards have a lot of potential because they could go on to be a champion, a Hall Famer, an All Star. We went to four different stores. We went to Meyer, we went to Target, we went to Dick's Sporting Goods, we went to Walmart. Kevin found a couple of these hockey uh, packs at Meyer. Slim Pickens. Couldn't find it out. Four also, stores. Also, want to let people know Dick's Sporting Goods does not have <laughs> trading cards. Found that out the hard way. This a guy box. said, Hey, I was going to buy these, but you know what, man? Here you go. And uh, I said, Thank you. And I immediately bought this pack. So, without further ado. First true rookie card, which is another Sadiq Bay rookie illusions card. Obviously, Sadiq Bay played the hometown Pistons and a lot of potential in this card. Mm -hmm. Sky's the limit for old Sadiq Bay. Oh, nice. Here we go. This guy had a lot of potential last year, but Emmanuel Quickly rookie card. Knicks kind of suck, but if Emmanuel Quickly can turn it on and have a have a dope career, then. This card, I'm, I'm seeing this card on eBay for, that's going for $300. I mean, that's minted, you send it out, you get it minted, you get it graded, but that's going for $300, and I'm currently about to buy this one in 38 seconds for $35.86. To hedge my bet, I increased my auto bid to $45. $44.50, let's go! $44.50. What? Bid, no fucking way. My auto bid was up to 45 bucks. Sold for 46, are you fucking kidding me? Another lesson. You know what, that just means I can put more money in on this one ending in about an hour. Two for one. You know, it just make them a little easier to open, I guess. That was hard, that was, that was rattling. That was, that was pretty, that was pretty fucked. You know what's fucked is trying to open these damn packs. <laughs> hey. Was trying to buy some cards, and unfortunately, through eBay, they said they were delivered. Those cards have have yet to have yet to show up. Contacted the seller. Seller said there was really nothing he could do. Is on USPS. Not even gonna waste my time trying to contact <laughs> USPS because they're just they're awful. They're absolutely you know, awful. I hope so. we can bring those on another episode. I sure. tell you what, if uh, I get these Joel, I actually got one Joel Embiid rookie card on the way. If I get this other one and they don't come in the mail, you might see me on the news because I might have contacted the USPS. Those cards. Cards better show up. I can't hear you. I got too many fucking cars with me right now. <laughs> oh, 
I mean, just a moment of silence before we start the first episode here for Baker Mayfield. We pay homage to him on the Cleveland Browns. And in that moment of silence, you just realize that you're coming away with Deshaun Watson. So any negative feelings you might have about losing Baker Mayfield, which I don't know exactly why you would have negative feelings, but. You like my Watson jersey? Hey, mm -hmm. not even on the market yet. This is the, the fabled box right here. Don't know when I got this or who made it for me, but inside is all our treasures here that we're gonna get into. I think IG Live would I be think incredibly you guys lit. Lit.